And here we are live. Uh, Star Trek Online, Charles III, the best ways to play Star Trek Online, A to Z, no alphabetical order. Now this isn't going to be the video, a series of videos. It's going to be a series of videos. This is just an introduction to it. Um, I'm giving myself making a five minute video. Then I'm going to play some regular Star Trek Online and, and, and consider it for the uh, near future what I'm exactly going to, how I'm going to do it and approach it. I uh, may have to wait till next month to actually do it on a budget. May just do some general videos over about tips, general tips or instructions on how to play. And maybe I'll start a new character because I have two or three uh, character slots in which I can create characters. I believe I, believe I have at least two more, and uh, I may use existing ships I have. Um, uh, ships because when you purchase ships on one character sometimes you can also get those ships on another character uh, though my plan is to make a video about the most efficient uh, and here it is here's the, here's the description to, uh, I will be making a series of videos on the best ways to play Star Trek Online the most efficient path with the least amount of money a medium budget of money to play and one for someone who has currency and money at some time available from equipment, computer, mouse, and keyboard, to what you spend your time and currency money on in game. And I will make a video on strategies of how to play and win and when you do not win, to learn from mistakes and have good sportsmanship, have little to no angry feelings about losses, about losing in the game. It's not the easiest game to play, and uh, I'm going to talk about how not to. Let yourself get nervous, concentrate, focusing on the steps, choosing uh, choosing times to be well rested and hydrated, well energized, focused time and play. I also want to touch on, talk about, uh, talk, talk, talk about um, sp not spending all your time focused in Star Trek Online. Do other things too. Uh, play no more than one hour a day. Uh, or talk about you know playing one hour a day when you first begin to play. So because I when I first started to play, even though I was an experienced kind of a somewhat experienced computer game player, I had difficulty. Um, I got very frustrated because I didn't have instructions on the exact instructions of what key functions to press and what mouse buttons to press, and there was no instructions online that I saw. So I had seen there were some videos, uh, but I didn't want to sit there and watch them. I wanted to get going and play the game. So the best way to get playing something sometimes is just to jump in and play it. But there is just a, only a computer. It is a computer game, but it's one of the greatest computer games on earth. Computer internet games. So if you think about it as a task to perform, uh, performing one step at a time, learning to play. Uh, and practice gets you better at things, you know. Not getting frustrated, you know. Having fun with it. Slow and steady wins, and everyone in Star Trek Online is a winner if they play and play without cheating others and themselves. So, if you can play the game, if you learn it step by step, right? And sometimes socialization in the game, even though it's an internet game, kind of like socialization on the internet is not a big thing, you know. It's not a major, it's not a, not too many people socialize too much, but yeah, you do. When you get more experience in the game, you can also ask other players for help and assistance. But I never got any assistance. I did it on my own from day one. I've been playing for two years and six months approximately. Started in October 2019. Uh, I consider myself one of the greatest uh, Star Trek online players of all time. Uh, first off in uh, sportsmanship, kindness. Second, uh, well, first off, the greatest. Uh, Strategic uh, strategy strategist of the game. That's that's all. Not promising when videos will be. However, hopefully things go as planned. Um, then uh, hopefully no later than April first, my first video. Hoping for tomorrow night to next week to do a general description of what's on my mind at the moment of how to play in competitive, be competitive at Star Trek Online, and maybe some Star Trek geek nerd thoughts about specific episodes of commentary and humorous remarks to keep you interested. <laughs> I don't think I can do impressions very well, but you know, some funny commentary might be fun. And uh, 
Here's the game. And the video's going to end right in three. Move my shift a little bit. Two, one.